Have you thought about selling but just don't know where to start? In today's video, I'm going to be going over the top four must do's when you plan to sell your home. Let's get into it. Hey everyone, welcome back. Nice to see you again. In today's video, we're going to be going over the top four most important must do's when you plan to sell your home. So you've taken the first step and decided it's time to sell your home. Now as a homeowner, you might have already been through this before, but if it's your first time, you might not know where to start. And that's exactly what I'm going to try and help you with in this video. On that note, let's get right into it. My must do number one is to consult a professional realtor. Professionals know the market and have a good understanding of where it's heading, what buyers are seeking, and how to help tick off all the right boxes in the most effective ways. If you're planning on selling and looking at doing some improvements beforehand, for example, I can't emphasize enough the importance of getting a consultation first. Talk to the pros. The most important strategy is to base your decisions on what buyers are looking for. You must not base your renovation decisions on your own personal tastes, such as your likes and dislikes. The key is to make those choices based on what the broadest range of buyers are looking for so you can improve your chances of appealing to the largest audience possible. A professional real estate consultant will guide you through that process and keep you focused. Must do number two is get an appraisal. You probably wouldn't sell your car without finding out what it's worth or sell a watch on eBay without finding out what similar items were selling for, right? Well, selling your home is no different. In fact, getting an appraisal probably makes even more sense given the potential dollar amounts you stand to make or lose depending on, upon your pricing decisions. An appraisal arms you with some important pieces of information that isn't accessible by most homeowners. Because conditions in the housing markets are constantly changing, you'll gain up to the moment information on the value of your home, value based on buyer demands, your neighborhood, what comparable homes known as comps are selling for, and much more. As a side note, as a real estate broker, I'm able to access sales prices and different market data that most homeowners are not able to access. And this allows me to provide you as a home seller with up-to-date information to correctly price your home. Now must do number three is get low down on the prepayment penalty. We find that sellers are often surprised to discover at the notary's office on closing day that they are facing a large mortgage discharge penalty. Highly discount mortgage rates over the past few years often came with serious fine print with respect to early payout, otherwise known as prepayment penalties. What I would suggest as one of my must do's is go to the bank who you currently have your mortgage with and ask what the penalty will be. This will eliminate those notary office surprises and make sure you put aside the necessary funds and are well prepared. Finally, our must do number four is to get on the radar right away. The final must do is short on the explanation, but big on the importance. Get your home out there and start creating early buzz. I strongly believe in getting your home on the radar as early as possible. When listing your home, the buyer attention span is short, so you have the highest chance of generating buyer interest within the first two to four weeks of the listing, otherwise the interest begins to fade. This means it's critical to get the listing right from the very start. Making sure your broker is implementing an effective marketing plan is important, but ultimately the price has to be right. Make sure you and your broker discuss your options and ultimately decide on a price that is going to attract as much interest as possible from the very start and get you on the buyer's radars right away. As a helpful hint, it is best to find a proactive broker that is going to implement a strong marketing strategy to attract buyers and make sure you price your home well. Remember, if your price is not compelling, your home is not selling. That concludes this week's video on the top four must do's when you plan to sell your home. Remember, Effectively selling your home is all about showing its desirability and making it create a buzz. And you can do that by following the four must do's I mentioned in this video. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new, don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to my channel. I have weekly videos coming out every week, so stay tuned for more and so make sure to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time.